Hey, good day, guys. Um, today we'll be talking about um the the, the relationship between the primary brain vesicles, um, uh, the secondary brain brain vesicles and the adult brain structures. Okay. All right. So um, let's not waste time. Um, let's proceed to what we got here. All right. So get my pen. The, the full question was um, describing a tabular form, the relationship between the primary brain ves vesicles, the five brain vesicles, and the adult uh, brain structures. Right? So just a brief summary. Uh, the primary brain vesicles, they are the ones that develop into the secondary brain vesicles. The secondary brain vesicles develop into the adult brain structures. Okay. So um, this is just an image summarizing everything that we'll be talking about in this handout. Um, this is the primary brain vesicles. Uh, we have the memory aid as PMR, okay, PMR, P is prosencephalon, M is mesencephalon, and um, R is a rhombencephalon, okay. The prosencephalon develops into the telencephalon and the diencephalon, okay. So I do say that uh, the prosencephalon develops into what? DT, okay. It develops into DT. Why the mesencephalon continues, okay. Um, why uh, the rumbent cephalon uh, develops into what? Mitten cephalon and the myelin cephalon. My memory aid for that is MM. Okay. Mitten cephalon and myelin cephalon. All right. Now, the telen cephalon develops into what? The cerebrum. Why the dying cephalon develops into the thalamus, hypothalamus, epithalamus, and all the thalamus that you know? Okay. Uh, why the mesencephalon continues? To develop as the midbrain, okay. The metencephalon develops into the pons and the cerebrum, okay. So this is basically just some um, development of the brain, okay. Embryology of the brain, okay. When they ask you to discuss the brain vesicles, it's just the embryology of the brain, okay. Now the myelencephalon develops into the medulla oblongata, right. So that this is basically what you said there, and prosencephalon that's a uh, PMR talking about the mnemonics um, vertically. Uh, P develops into DT, that's the telencephalon and the diencephalon. Telencephalon is the word cerebral hemisphere. Diencephalon is the thalamus, metathalamus, hypothalamus, subthalamus, epithalamus. Mesencephalon has no problem. It continues as mesencephalon and develops into the brain. Okay. Uh, um, then the metencephalon develops into the pons. And the cerebrum, sorry. Okay. Why the myelin cephalon develops into the medulla? Okay. So this is another image for you to feed on. You could pause this video to look at this image in details. Okay. Uh, just just a beautiful one. Okay. So with these guys, I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. And bye for now.